Attenuator here. Quick cap of what you're hearing. Just wrote the beat 2022 and threw in the vocal. And then I got pissed off. So I was having a mute record that I didn't want to happen. And we figured out why in the comments of the video where I accused Akai of a bug. So I'm sorry, Akai. Uh, let's talk about what happened. Up top here you have this row of really small buttons and if you toggle this from red to green for read to write, that's a global recording automation. And it happens regardless of whether or not you've got record toggled there, which you have to combine the record enabling there and hit record the button to then hit a pad and record into the uh, device. So. That all makes sense, but this global thing was confusing until after it had tripped me up and people commented on my original video. I'll post the link, you can go and laugh. It's pretty funny, I was pissed. So let's do the uh, trigger here. So if we mute, you can mute it from up here, um, or you can have mute toggled down here, and then hit the number or the button below the number, so in this case the octave minus sign, and it unmutes it. Now if you have it not just read, but it's write enabled, that's a global enablement, and then you mute, it's kind of cool. Now I've got a loop that says this is what. But I didn't want that when I was messing around and it got me really mad that it was recording something and I didn't pay attention to that little button. You can reach that button in the clip area as well under a range and it's right here. You can toggle between read and write. So back to the matrix and I can hit undo to clear that and let's undone the events. So to solve that problem, we're going to go to page 83 in the manual and read for just a second. Woo! Okay. Page 83 of the Force 3.1 user guide slash manual. I save it as that so I can search it easier. Uh, we're going to scroll to this global automation part here. So it's referencing the I go away, sidebar. The pull down menu. Here we go. The pull down menu contains the following controls. The tap the global automation button, which is here. This read and write toggle. And that'll turn all of them off for all the tracks. So you don't have to mess with those little buttons and you can temporarily shut it all down. So to do so, you hold shift and tap the button. Let's go back and do that real quick. Page 83. All right, once again, sorry Akai, but I'm learning along the way just like everyone else. So we've got the uh, mixer and input output and we can toggle the read write. It looks like they're all right right now. W-R-I-T-E that is. And it's because if you pull down from the top, this is toggled to write. Now I can toggle them to read, and they've all turned green. So we are not going to record any automations. And if we want that to go away, we hold shift and touch the button. Well, hold shift and hit the button, and you see it turns off. If we go back out here, they're all grayed out. There's no green or red in the global automation buttons. So now mute's not going to record. We can toggle mute. Now why is this useful? Well, we can toggle it to be active on all of them with the drop and have them all on right. Or we can toggle some to be able to be recorded and we can do a lot of automations all at once. 
And when we're done with automations, well, I wish that was easier to toggle down, the more uh, consistent, hold that shift and turn it off. And then we can go back into playing tracks and hitting buttons and not toggling a record. So keep that one in mind. It's a quick access to turn off and on all eight or to turn off all the ones that you enabled for writing and uh, increase your workflow there. Automations are really important for adding a live element to your music. And so we'll do some more work in automations in upcoming videos. I appreciate the commenters. Thanks for everyone who posted there. We have some other bug fixes we might be chasing. New firmware that just came out, 3.1.3. It's Wi-Fi only at the moment. Look for my video there. Not available on their website yet and no release notes. So we're all gonna work together, get smarter, and start hammering out fab beats. Pretend you Raider out.